The question is, freely getting too skinny, all that fructose. Now, here in Australia here is a big thing about fructose. Fructose makes you fat, and a lot of haters say to Freely, you're too skinny, you're too scrawny, and you eat too much fructose. Fructose makes you fat, and you're too skinny, Freely. And all sorts of crazy, creepy shit like that they write. And Freely put up this video recently, the skinny bitch book look, look book or whatever it's called, uh, and she got even more haters on there. You're too skinny. You look like a slut. All this sort of crazy stuff. And they're always people who are out of shape. So here is Freely here. Is she too thin? Is she too skinny? What do you, and just on another side note, what do you think of that new camera? Do you like the fisheye lens? Or would you prefer a HD quality, uh, you know, traditional style lens? Do you like the fisheye? Or would you prefer just a traditional style camera with no fisheye effect? Let us know down below. Yes, fisheye, no fisheye. So getting back to the subject, is, is she too thin? Is she too slim? Is all that fructose leaning her out too much? What's the deal? There's a new movie that's come out in Australia, coming out soon. It's called uh, it's called That Sugar Film. It's another low-carb bullshit where you get a couple of wank tanks on there with too much money or with a few connections in the uh, Australian film industry. You put together a little doc, well, they call it a documentary. It's basically just a, a little finance thing by the Meat and Livestock Australia to get the meat-eating consumption a bit higher up and less fruit. Don't eat too much fruit, Australia, because you might look like Frilly the Banana Girl. Fruit makes you fat, and Banana Girl, she's too skinny. She's too skinny. Even the dog's fucking skinny. <laughs> you hang out with Frilly and Duran Rider, and eventually you're going to look like us. Lean, thigh gap, slim, trim. And Freely doesn't. Freely looks like an Olympic runner, Olympic level cyclist. She doesn't have the fitness level of one though because she doesn't do that much training. She does do a bit of training though. You got to do a bit of training to keep the tone. But it's your diet that's going to keep you slim long term. And if you want to speed up results, get on the bike for sure. Just rolling around, riding around. It gets the blood going. You got to have some glow in your face, some colour, and sports going to help you do that. A bit of cycling. So for these sports cyclists. This is a cyclist physique here. Do a little dance. Don't give up your day job, Freely. Don't give up your day job. And uh, there you go. Little figs in the background. It is It is a crazy world out there. People in Australia saying, Bananas, I'd like to look like Freely, but fruit's got too much sugar. It's like, hang on, what the fuck did you just say? I'd like to look like Freely, but fruit's got too much sugar. Well, how come you overweight if you don't eat like Freely long term? You know, what I mean? like people, people are tripping, or people might try to live our lifestyle for a month or two months and not get the results, and go, "Oh, look, it took them years to get the results, but it's only got, should only take me a month or so because I'm extra special." So, like, nah, it takes time. It fucking takes time. Good things take time. Good things take time, but you won't get that in any fancy feel-good uh, fake documentary. We just tell legit shit here. But it is hilarious here. So, really flaunts a flaunts a thing on the internet, and people tell us, "You guys are wrong." You're wrong. <laughs> our reply is, I don't even know what the fuck our reply is anymore. What is our reply? I don't even fucking know because it's just hilarious, man. I mean, it's just like, what the fuck do we say? Well, I mean, what do you say at this point? What do you say at this point? We've got so much social media presence, myself and Freely, just killing it on social media. What do you say at this point? What do you, I mean, we've got over about 9 million views in the last 30 days combined on YouTube. Just myself and Freely. Over 9 million views in the last 30 days. And people say we're wrong. Cars make you fat. You guys are wrong. You guys, and you guys are too skinny, by the way. I don't even know what to say anymore. What do you, what, what, what's the next step? So it's a good thing that my book, my book out, Carb the Fuck Up. It talks about it more on that. A little plug there for the book. Carb the fuck up. It, we talk about the insanity of society in there. There's another little floral top, floral top freely got. You know, it's uh, I like this one. It's, it's a nice, good fit. It's a, it's a functional top. You could run a marathon in this. Only wear clothing you could run or ride your bike in. Be probably get a bit sunburned on my shoulders there. What do you think of this fish eye lens? I don't really rate it. I prefer the straight up and down lens. 
Let us know down below. What do you think of the fish eye? Is freely too thin? Are we crazy? What do you say to people? What do you, what is, I mean, what do you do when your friends and family who are overweight or obese tell you that the people on YouTube that you follow, freely and drew or whatever, they're wrong? Those guys are wrong. That's too many carbs. Carbs make you fat. Oh, they, and then you show me a video of us and they're, oh, they're, they're painfully thin. They're wasting away. What do you reply to that one? I think you just got to have a sense of humor in life. And you just got to laugh at the insanity of it all. Because if you take things too seriously, you'll definitely burn out. So you just got to have fun and troll till four. Raw till four, troll till four. And then the rest of the night, just plan what you're going to do the next day. Have fun with it all, end of the day. Just have fun with it all. Because again, like I said before, if you take it too seriously, you'll crack. And I say so many people in life, they're not having fun. You gotta have fun in life. And you gotta align your life with your values. And you gotta have fun doing it, man. If your life ain't fun, you know, if you're having to use drugs and that to enjoy yourself, you're doing the wrong things. You're living the wrong lifestyle. Or you've got the wrong mentality. So carve the fuck up. Develop an attitude of gratitude. Develop a work ethic at writing down your goals and attacking them every day. Get the job done. Get the job done. Thanks for watching.